Only a couple of home games this past weekend for your Bears and Pandas, but let's start with Golden Bears hockey with a home and home against Calgary. Friday night in front of a packed arena, the Dinos jumped to a 4-1 lead only for the Bears to tie it up in the third period. However, the Dinos took the lead with four minutes left and added the empty netter to take the 6-4 win. The following night in Calgary, it was the Dinos on top again with the 5-3 victory. Bears are now in third place and will look to get back on track against the first place Huskies at Claire Drake this weekend. Pandas hockey coming off the incredibly close 1-0 double overtime loss to the Dinos on Friday stole the show in Saturday's game in honor of mental health awareness. The Pandas scored twice in the final six minutes of the third period to beat the Dinos 3-1 with goals from Froehler, Poznikov and Cunningham. Lindsay Post put up 21 saves in the win and the Pandas will head back on the road next weekend to face the Huskies. On the road, Golden Bears Volleyball kept the streak alive and remained undefeated after a pair of victories against the Regina Cougars. The Bears are 20-0 and, and have four more games left to win to remain perfect in the regular season. The team has a bye this weekend and will be back home on the 12th against Calgary. The Pandas also earned the weekend sweep in Regina with a straight sets win on Friday, followed up by a 3-1 victory on Saturday. The Pandas are comfortably in third place in Canada West with a 16-4 record and face the 9-11 Dinos next. Pandas basketball continued their dominant season with a pair of wins in Lethbridge, led by U Alberta Athlete of the Week L Hendershot, who put up a pair of double doubles, including Saturday's big 19 and 14 performance. The Pandas are in second place and will be home this weekend against the Spartans. Bears basketball dropped both games against the Pronghorns to bring the record to 7 and 8, but remain in the last playoff spot. Lyndon Annette dropped a season high 20 points on Friday to lead the way with Mamadou Gea putting up 19 the following night.